Welcome back to Infigan friends. Today in this video we are going to take up another exciting challenge from Math Olympiad. We have to evaluate x power 40 plus 1 over x power 40 and given equation is 9x plus 1 over 3x equal to square root 6. So let's get started by writing our equation once. 9x plus 1 over 3x equal to square root 6. Now I will divide both sides by 3. So here we can write by 3 and here we can write 1 by 3. Now let's multiply this 1 by 3 into the bracket. So we will multiply with both the terms. So I can write 3x plus 1 over 9x. And right hand side will become square root 6 over 3. Now I will consider squaring both sides. So let us write whole square. Let us write whole square this side also. Now I will write one property for RHS a over b whole power n. Then we can write a power n over b power n in RHS. Left hand side a plus b whole square formula. So let us write a square. So I will write 3x whole square. b square. So I will be writing 1 over 9x whole square plus 2ab 2 times 3x times 1 over 9x and right hand side using this property we can write root 6 square divided by 3 square. Now this is square root and power 2 will be over. Now what we will have 9x square plus 1 over 9 square is 81 x square is x square plus I can cancel this x with x and 3 I will cancel this denominator 9 by 3 and numerator will be 2 times 1 so I will be writing overall value is 2 by 3. If you will check right hand side it is equal to 6 by 9. Let's rewrite here. So I will write 9x square plus 1 over 81x square plus 2 by 3 and 6 over 9 we can write 2 by 3. So these two terms will be over. Now what is left? It is only 9x square plus 1 over 81x square and right hand side is 0. Now I will multiply this equation by 81x square. So let's multiply both sides with 81x square. So let me write 81x square times 9x square plus 1 over 81x square and right hand side you will have 0 times 81x square. So I can write here 9 times 81 so it will be 729 x power 4 and this term will be 1 right hand side will be 0. If you will see what is 729 then we can write it as 3 power 6 81 times 9. So we can write here 3 power 6 x power 4 plus 1 equal to 0. Take away 1 from both sides. So 3 power 6 x power 4 equal to negative 1 or we can write x power 4 will be equal to minus 1 over 3 raised to the power 6. This is our x power 4. Now what we have to evaluate it is x power 40 plus 1 over x power 40. Let's calculate. So 
So first I will write x power 4 equal to minus 1 over 3 power 6. So I can consider squaring here. I can find out x power 8 which will be positive. So let us consider a square. So I will write x power 4 whole square. So I need to write minus 1 over 3 power 6 whole square. Now if a times b whole power is n, then we can write it is a power n times b power n. So this I will apply here. So I can write minus 1 power 2 and then I will be writing 1 over 3 power x whole power 2. So this will give us plus value and value will be 1 over 3 power 6 whole square. So we can write in this manner. Now it is a power b power c. Property is a power b times c. So we can write RHS as 3 raised to the power 12 in the denominator. And left hand side it is 2 times 4. So x power 8 will be 3 power 12 in the denominator. Numerator is 1. Now task is very easy. x power 40 we will calculate from here. x power 8 equal to 1 over 3 raised to the power 12. Consider power 5 both sides. So I will write power 5. So I need to write RHS power 5. So I will write x power 8 times 5. And here I will be writing 1 power 5 divided by 3 power 12 whole power 5. 1 power 5 is 1. Using the same exponent law, I can write it is 12 times 5, which is further equal to 1 over 3 raised to the power 60. And left hand side, it is 8 fives of 40 in the exponent equal to 1 over 3 raised to the power 60. Let's calculate our required expression. So I will be writing here x power 40 plus 1 over x power 40. This value will be equal to 1 over 3 raised to the power 60 plus we can write here 1 over x power 40 will be reciprocal of RHS. So 3 power 60. So it will become 3 power 60. I can take LCM also. So let us take LCM. 1 plus 3 power 60 times 3 power 60 divided by 3 power 60. Now using exponent law, a power x times a power y, any time we can write addition in the exponents. So just by applying this property, we will have our final answer. It will become x power 40 plus 1 over x power 40. This will become 1 plus 3 raised to the power 120, 60 plus 60 divided by 3 raised to the power 60. So this is our final and perfect answer. I hope friends this video will be somewhere meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself. Bye bye.